Hey, what's going on guys and girls? I'm Kylie Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 5 of my Ark Survival Evolved Crystal Isles official Let's Play series. So, today I don't really know what we're going to do. I'm feeling like total butthole right now. Um, but I wanted to get a video up today. Even though I'm not feeling so, so crash hot. So... We're going to just fly around and have a look what we can see. This video might be a bit shorter than normal just because I'm feeling like absolute dog doo doo. But we'll see how we go. It depends. I might feel better after a little bit. You never know. What the? And they're always. Every time I find a Baryonyx, they're always such a shite level, dude. Come here. Like, I really want to get a good one, but they, they're just never good. I've seen so... I saw so many of my original, um, modded map series that I would have thought by now I would have at least found one good one, but no. I'll get out of here. I mean, I wouldn't... like I said, I wouldn't mind having a Barry. Uh, there's nothing really around that I can see. Not too, 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 too much. And this microphone needs to sit in front of my mouth and stay there. It just doesn't want to stay there. Now we could, um... Actually, we could try and get a Wyvern today. That wouldn't be a bad idea. We're, I think we have to be minimum of level 65 and we're above that now, so we'll be able to do it. Sarko 150! Hmm. Hmm. What are you trying to kill? Oh, there's a 140 and a 150 there. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I, I'd like to try and... Oh, is that Capro? Yeah, they're always, again, not high levels. Like, I'm not sure about trying to tame a Capro, because I feel like you want a bowler that boy, because otherwise he's going to jump and eat your face off. I mean, I guess you could maybe float above him and just spam him with Trank darts or Trank, trank arrows, but... um. I don't know how that would go. That's at level 50, right? Yeah, 85. It's not too bad. Uh, but there was some really cool wyverns over here that I wanted to have a look at. We need to get some prime or some, some good crystal. What are you doing? You can get out of here. You're a horrid level. Got some Sarko skin, man. Alright, so... Yeah, I think it's called Prime Crystal. Let's see if we can get any. Dude, can we can we get it from this, or is that another thing? Because you used to get a bunch of different kinds of crystal, but maybe you don't get it from here anymore. Maybe you've got to get it from somewhere specific, so I'll have to give that a look. Alright, guys and girls. So, I have looked into how to get the Prime Crystal. So, more or less, we have to knock a Wyvern out. Uh, and then take its prime crystal and then use it on either that wyvern or another wyvern. So that's going to make it a little bit more complicated. Um, I can... I can make some dino gates and use some honey to lure it over and then trap them to knock them out, which probably honestly would be the best best thing to do. Um, yeah, I'm thinking, yeah, 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 that would, oh, wait, I already had it on me. That'd be probably the best thing to do. So, that means we need to get Dino Gate. Let's get the stone ones. Uh, Dino. I need stone and thatch, of course I do. Always got to be something. Figured I'd probably need the stone. All right, let's get this. Also, get some thatch. Dino. Okay, I don't have the wood with me. I can I can get that very easily. No, I can't. I'm short. Fuck. Dino. 
Yeah, I'm short on the stone. All right, we got two gyno, dino gates. Let's just drop that. Two dino gates. We need to go grab some honey so we can drop it so it gets attracted to it. And then we can go and try and get one of these crystal wyverns. Uh, a bit of honey out of here. Don't need too, too much. We'll just bring a small amount with us. As you can see, I've been farming up those cakes, though. We've got a lot of cakes. A lot of cake slices. Okay, so now we need to find one and knock it the hell out. There we go. Also, probably have to set this guy to passive. We're going to try and... Try and do it. Put him on passive for a moment. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to... Not do that. We're not going to eat it. We're going to... Can I not... Can I not drop one? How do I... How does one... Oh, do I got to put it... Like, how does one drop it? Aha. Okay. We should put the dino gates on our thing here as well. Let's see if he comes for it. Might take a little bit of time for him. I hope he doesn't land over there. I want him to land over next to me. Well, at least I know how to drop it now, so we're going to put another one. Is that all of it? No, you've, you're fucking kidding me. Oh my god. No, he ate... Oh, you son of a bitch. Alright. We're going to do this the hard way. If we can. I need to be around at the front of his neck. No, you piece of shit. All right. All righty then. Okay. Ah, oh, mad as hell. Well, I guess I have to go get more honey now, don't I? Okay, I'm back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. So, now if we do this. We get the dino gate ready. Okay, that works, I guess. I don't think he can get out. Where's my Pteranodon? He's far enough away. Alright. So how much Torpor can he take? 3,000? Alright, we'll be able to knock him with this pretty easily. We just gotta watch out because he'll blow his uh, stuff on us. I don't think he can break the stone gateway. I hope not. We should be able to knock this guy out. Come on. So, so far we've gone through 10 tranks. Ten tranks got us. Pretty much halfway there so far. Okay, so there's another one over there. Actually hoping that one's a higher level over there. I should have knocked out a lower level one. Hmm. It's not. Oh, missed that one. Come on. You'll go down eventually, bud. I started with 174 tranks, now I'm down to 150. I think I actually had 175 tranks, just missed it again. So I actually, weirdly, I, 
I think I kind of preferred the way you used to do it, but maybe that's just because I'm a little bit lazier. Alright, so now we can take the crystals if we jump up on his back. We ended up with 62 of them. Alright, that's a bit much. Alrighty. So now we got 62 crystals. Now how fast will this guy wake up? I don't think I'm going to have be able to tame him because he's going to be pissed at me um, for knocking him out. I'm pretty sure. So I don't think I'm going to be able to tame the same Wyvern as much as that would be nice. Crystal's recharging. Oh, I can't even search inside of him, actually. You can't. I was going to feed him uh, stim berries, but you can't. Okay. So we could just wait for this guy to wake up and see what happens. Um, if I'm going to do that. Oh, no, he's already up. Is he mad at me still? Oh, yeah, he's still, he's still pissed. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Don't die, 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 don't die. Oh, my God, how much health do I have? 2.5 out of 200. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh man, that was that was cutting it close, dude. 0.5 health left. Holy shit. Just broke me. Oh, well, we know there's a level 50 around. That guy's stuck. I don't think I'm even going to be able to take the dino gates away right now because anytime I go near him, he's going to try and kill me. So he might just be stuck in there forever. Let's see if there's anything good around that we can try and tame. Because these have got a timer on them as well. They're 42 minutes. So we've got about 20 minutes of time roughly to try and find a good wyvern. That was very, very lucky, dude. I might even just go and drop this honey off as well. Because I don't... Oh, I don't need most of it on me. I'll keep a little bit on me, but I don't need so many. I only brought so many in case I messed it up again. So just remember, if you're going to do that, drop the... Uh, or sort the... Are you dead? No. Um, sort the honey into into one each, so you don't drop twenty one in a stack and have the wyvern fly past and eat it all in one hit, and it's just a massive waste. Okay. My God, that was ridiculous. Okay, so now let's just stack these back up. We'll keep we'll keep a couple on me. Um, in case I need them. I don't even really need so many of these crystals, though. I can see I got 62. This doesn't look like 62 to me. And also, they will... Um, actually, I'll keep more on me. They will degrade... Uh, like, they, they, they don't stay unspoiled in a preserving bin, even though I just put them in there. I know that. They need to be inside of a wyvern to not spoil faster. Or to not spoil as fast. So we're going to have to find one that we can tame. That guy, I'm pretty sure, is just going to be pissed at us forever. As much as I would have liked that. I should have gone for the lower level 50. Um, and then used that to tame the 95. But, you know, my brain no works so good. <laughs> Didn't really think about it too much. Oh, wait. That's the 95. He's not in. He's not stuck. He, he uh, I went out of render range. And he's cool. Is he cool with me, though, or is he pissed at me? Is he mad at me? I think he's mad at me, maybe. No, he's not mad at me. All right, so we can follow him and we can tame this guy. We just need him to land. And then we jump up on him. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, he's not mad at me. Okay, cool. We do this, and we push this button, Oop. throw that out to him, and we jump up on his back. Do 
if I can. I'm trying very, very hard to jump up on this guy's back, and it ain't working. Oh my god, I keep bumping his wings. I don't remember it being this far out. Whoa. That's actually the one I want more, because it looks way cooler, but this guy's just a way better level. Alright, now I'm on his back. So now I put one of these crystals in the last taming slot, and I go bang, and he'll... T oh, tamed him one shot. Oh, he lights up, dude! Alright, I didn't expect that to be one. I thought it'd be at least two. Oh, dude. Yo! This guy looks sick, and he's the right colours for the channel, too. Alright, well, now we should be able to... Right, so we've got a 38-minute spoiler time. Five hours. Very, very good. Very cool indeed. And he just lights up the night sky, man. Look at them. Look at him. I think he's one of the better crystal wyverns I've seen in terms of colors. Like, he's just straight up blue. And seemingly when I tame him, he's... He lights up. He wasn't lit up before I tamed him. And then the second I put those crystals in his body, he was like, Hell yes, I am fantastic. How are you? Dude, this is sick. Oh my god. You look incredible. You look absolutely incredible. Um, can I... I need to get this... Oh, wait, the Pteranodon's finally going to land. I'm going to put you over here. Next to things for protection. Yeah, no, this guy looks sick. I'm going to go check out the volcano area using this guy. Um, what's he going to look like if I gamma up? Still pretty cool. Not as cool as when it's a bit darker, but still pretty cool. I don't know whether he's faster or whether the Pteranodon's faster, to be honest. I've got classic flyers. Why can I not increase this guy's movement speed? Like, that should work with Wyverns. Maybe it just doesn't work with Wyverns. I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on there. Maybe we can try and get this red drop over here too, even. That could be something we could try. And if we see another really cool wyvern, we um, we have the things on us to try and tame one as well. I don't know whether we'll find one this nice. We might. Some of the blood wyverns have some pretty cool things about them as well. Yeah, this guy seems pretty slow, really. Just the dodo's pattering feet? Yeah, I guess it is. So this guy, I think, eats meat. Normally. It's an interesting spot for a red drop, though. Like, what's the... I don't know whether the red drops are being changed, because the modded version, most of the time I, I got a red drop, was always ammo. Nope, it's better. We got some poly out of that. We got some flak mastercraft armor. We're going to chuck that straight on. I might try and kill a few things with this guy. See if there's anything around here to kill. Well, there's some stuff to harvest. That'll actually give me a level still. Is that bees are here? All right, hang on. This guy must be a decent level. What is he? 100 Thyla. Not that good.
Alright, I've pissed off every thorny dragon in the in the immediate area. And the Thyla. You know, I didn't see one Thyla the entire last Crystal Isle series, and now I've seen a couple. Okay, we need to land. Can we land on this? Yes, we can. Okay. Need to bump up that melee though, and that stam. Um, hello. Is a Thyla coming at you? Oh, I hit him good then. Don't hit the water. And they're fast, dude. They're fast and he's pissed. Holy shit. You're, you're joking, right? Okay, he'll be dead in one more hit. If I can hit him. Okay, there we go. My god. That man's did not want to die. We got a Thyla hook claw. Ooh, righty. Oh shit. some good keratin. Get some really good amounts of keratin. So what what is this buff? Hydrated. Speed, health, regeneration, and damage are boosted. Interesting. Wait, so you're telling me from skimming the water it did that? Yup. Oh. Interesting. I don't think I've ever seen that buff. Maybe I'm completely incorrect about that, but I don't remember seeing that buff. Nice, very nice. Alrighty. So we got... We still got prime crystals in here. Thought I'd put them all in him. So we got a four hour spoil time on those ones. Man, they drained quite a lot sitting in my inventory, didn't they? Holy hell. This is so cool. This is absolutely just dope. Wait, are we even heading the right direction? Um. Yeah, we're kind of heading. I want to see what's in this area over here on the way back. Like this, this section up here. So I know I can get a Thyla, which Thylas are probably... They're, they're up there with one of my favourite creatures. You can get some really sick mutations out of them. Like, you can get bright blue mutations and stuff like that. And they just look incredible when they're mutated. Um, which we will get into at some point. Obviously, I was going to get into mutations in my other series until the save got deleted. Because I actually had some good dinos that would have probably come up with some really cool mutation babies. But um, not anymore. That is not a thing anymore, unfortunately, so we'll uh, we'll get to it at some point in this series as well. I don't want to go straight into breeding and mutate in the second the series starts. If I get a really sick dino and try and get another one, like like we could even try for some mutated sarcos, but I don't know what kind of mutations you can get on them. I've never really looked into it much. I'm sure you can get some pretty sick colours though, but I'll have to have a look at that. Like what's some of the, my favourite dinos are the ones I had or I have on Aberration, which I haven't done that series in a while. The, the save and everything's still there for it, I believe. Um, but I've got, like, some Valentine's Day ones. So, like, my, my Kikinos has got, like, purple underbelly and everything, and it, it just looks awesome. This is, like, swamp, I guess. It's, uh, ce it's center, central river still. And this central river is massive. I guess it goes all the way through the map. Like, it's pretty broad. Oh, hello. 
It's the same level blood crystal with it. Will he be pissed if I go near him? No, they're cool. I swear I got attacked by a blood crystal wyvern at some point. I don't know why. I swear I did. I wonder if I wonder if the artifacts are all in the exact same spots, all the ones we did, because we had like. But that's the most, probably the most annoying part of that whole series is I was starting to ready up to try and fight some bosses in that series. I had like 12 out of the 16 potential artifacts that I needed. Um, and then the save went. So um, maybe even when I finish recording this episode, I'm actually going to back up the save just to make sure that that doesn't happen again. And in the future, if I see that there's an arc update, I'll just re-back it up again because I don't trust the devs at all to hold on to saves. Even though I think holding on to single player saves really shouldn't be that complicated. Um, but, you know, why why would I ever be surprised with anything Wildcard ever does nowadays? But we achieved today's goal. We got ourselves a Crystal Wyvern. and it's not the best level. But we can always find better level ones. You know, this isn't the only one we're ever going to get. I ended up with three in one episode in my last Crystal Isle series because... The, the way to get the crystals was just to mine the crystals. Like, you just mine crystals, you'd end up with all these different kinds of crystals that you could use to then tame them. Like, don't get me wrong, I love the look of these prime crystals. Like, if there's a way I can put them on the ground and just have them around to, to just look at, I'd be pretty pretty happy with that, but I don't think there is a way. I don't even know what happens if I go and try to, like, use one. Can't use it. You drop it, it comes a bag. What if you put it here? No, there's no placing them or anything like that, unfortunately. That would have been pretty cool if you could place them. That's for sure. Alright. So yeah, anyway guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. But if you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Ark Survival Evolved in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, peace!